I'm Nicole Servinas reporting from the 33rd edition of Honda Indy Toronto, where I got to speak with Robert Wickens, who is an inspiration to many people. Now, he was Indy's fastest rising star only just a year ago until he suffered a terrible accident. Here comes the red machine, the Lucas Oil entry of Canada's Robert Wickens. Oh, that's going to be tight through there. Oh, oh my God. Round goes to the right. Oh, that's Robert Wickens. What has been probably the most difficult part of this journey and what has kept you kind of going forward? You can't expedite this this injury, you know, and, and basically depending on how badly damaged your spinal cord is, it, it will vary your outcome. And not only that, every the human body is a crazy thing and every person will heal differently. So it's there's the worst answer you could ever get in the hospital, and I kept asking it all the time, was basically, you know, will I walk again? They're like, well, every injury is different. The hardest part was just understanding what rehab was going to be like. No one really told us at the beginning what our future entailed. We kind of thought we were going to go home and, you know, heal the, the wounds and the bones and then learn how to walk. We didn't know that rehab was 90% of bowel and bladder and learning how to relive your life. With my physical therapist, I, I found a way to stand up by basically like crawling up the person. <laughs> right and I was like oh wow then the way we were standing we were like kind of like in a dancing position and I was just like okay and so I kept practicing it kept practicing it while Carly was away and then when she came back um, after after working and, and came back to Denver to see me I was like I was, couldn't wait for her to get there because I just wanted to show her it's so crazy that you couldn't do this before Obviously, one of the things that you had said is that you really wanted to dance, to have your first dance together when you guys get married in a couple months. Um, what does that mean to you to kind of, when he said that to you, what was your reaction, Carly? I mean, we've, we have always dreamed of this day and getting to dance is, I know, really important for both of us at the wedding. Look, you're standing! We're dancing. We're both Rob and I say, it's not gonna be that different than what he could have done before. <laughs> <laughs> we'd just be like a high school dance, just kind of two feet apart. <laughs> Sorry, we squeezed you too hard. I am getting back into a car. This, this was the longest I've ever not driven anything in my, since I was seven years old. I'm getting into an Acura NSX with hand controls prepared by uh, Aero. And the icing on the cake is that I am doing it during the Honda of Toronto. I will be doing the parade lap before the start of the race. On Sunday, I get to do the parade lap, but what's gonna make it even sweeter is that I get to have Carly in the passenger seat with me. You look so good in the car! It's gonna be uh, a really good moment for us. You know, it's probably gonna be, it's probably gonna be the most emotional part of, of the injury so far is probably sharing that parade lap. 